Hey everyone, Paragear USA back again for another war recap. And this time we went against level 10 clan class X, class E X, I don't know how to say that, but um, we lost. Uh, although we were heavily um, at, in a disadvantage. So they have two Town Hall 11s. We had four. Um, but they have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten Town Hall 10 attack attackers. Um, some of these were 9.5 bases. Um, but they had Town Hall 10 offense. So, although they were still um, Town Hall 9-ish um, defenses, they still had... 20 plus or 20 town hall 10 attacks to use against our nines and honestly i think all of these all of these three stars you can see were by their town hall 10s this is the uh, one of the only town hall 9 versus town hall 9 three stars there's two a three i think I'm, I'm not sure. I think Baster is... I think he's a 10. Yeah, and the rest of these Town Hall 8s. So, yeah. They just... We were way outmatched. We put up a good fight. Um, but they just had way too many... Uh, too much offense for us. Uh, more than we can handle. I'm going to show some attacks, uh, play some music, and we're going to get on with it. Number 30 against number one. He still has his heroes. You get that extra percentage and the two star. Great job, experiment. Good job, Bluto. Thanatos. Muhammad. Bluto again, Thanatos, and Clutch is um, is our former leader, Jay. Um, he he took a break for a while. He came back, doing some wars with us, and hopefully he's going to stay for a while. So we'll show uh, we'll show one of his one of his hits here, um, just because just because it's Jay. Beginning is kind of slow, I guess. I'm not sure. It looked like everything just ignored the jumps that he put down and said, screw it, we're going to walk around the base just for the hell of it. Bad luck, Jay. It sucks. Mojo Ryzen. 
10 all 10 versus uh, he's a 9.5 but still we'll show it good job mojo uh, mojo has been hanging out in our um, 2.1 USA adults 2.1 for a while and came over and doing some more uh, with us and he's doing some good things glad to have you bro Great job, man. Lucky had a 99%. Well, I'll show it just because um, it was a good attack. He just must have missed something somewhere. Ball breaker. Nope. Ball breakers got in. I think I was going to attack this base and then I changed my mind and I hit a base that was scouted um, by uh, Lucia but it was scouted for Luke and I didn't know that someone just updated our cleanup list uh, a little wrong and I ended up hitting his base and three starred it. Sorry, Luke. What was it? Corner hut? No, oh, chest. Corner troll Tesla. Go figure. A troll Tesla for the win. <laughs> for them. That sucks. Yeah, that's a perfect Laloon base. Um, he's got an air defense and a sweeper next to uh, the Archer Queen, which, I mean, honestly, I, all you need is what uh, Experiment did here. King, Golem, create a funnel, get him in there, kill the Queen. Um, you're going to get the air defense and the sweeper, plus handle the CC troops. Uh, and then Laloon the rest of it. Not a good base design. These guys had some great bases, but this one, I mean, for someone that knows what they're doing, if you go against a random clan that has mediocre attackers, um, it's not a bad base, but for people that know what they're doing, yeah, it's, you probably need to redesign that or have a backup base. I have five, well, well, four bases that I use for war, um, and one that I can, so I have my regular farming base, um, then I have one that's empty, and then one war base, and then on my war, um, three war bases, uh, if I make a new one, I can, I can copy it and put it into the empty into the empty base or recycle one of the ones that, that I don't use. So I can rotate through, I can ro rotate through four bases using five slots. So depending on who we're, we're at war with, I'll, I'll change it out. 
this one I, I don't even know what I did wrong there I'll show I'll show it because I'm sure I screwed it up Oh yeah, it's double jump bomb right there, got me. And I knew it was there. I knew it was there. And I put too many hogs up top. Stupid. That's what happens when you try to rush your um, attacks. I tried placing my spells out in front of the troops, and it just seems like they all avoided every dang spell that I dropped for them. Uh, so I rely on the... Um, the Valks down here, I was worried because there's a DE drill. I thought I was going to get the 99%. Luckily that golem breaks through and tanks. Um, tanks for some of my troops. And if you watch the queen, we'll slow it down. That was speeding it up. but Look, so there's a, there's a path. Oh, there's a builder hut over there. That's why. Stupid. She could have just went right there. Sometimes I wonder. Anyway, got the three star. I'll take it. I'm surprised that quake didn't open that compartment right there. It was close. Jump bomb. Oh, good thing they split. We just got singles. Uh, so it damaged that wall. It just didn't. He must have been off on one, uh, one of his EQs, which caused them to not open that corner. Either way, great job, Dragon Knight. That's a bad spot for a double giant bomb. Right in front of your archer queen. That's that's pretty stupid. And bad pathing. You need to remove that Tesla right there. You would have got a bunch of bacon. Had that Tesla not been there, he would have he would have killed all his hogs. But, of course, it's single triggered because that um, Tesla was there.
And clean up. Great job, Shifty. And heebie jeebies queen for the win and the save. Nice job, buddy. Well, that's it. No, it's not a dip. Well, I mean, it's a dip, but it's still a town hall nine. These guys had um, way higher. Uh, hero levels than we did too so he had to drop down from 10 to 21 um, to get that we had to use a lot of our bottom uh, bottom bases our town hall eights uh, and stuff as scouts uh, because there were no bases to hit they had town hall nines all the way down to i think the bottom two were town hall eights something like that charm Going way too fast through that. Great job, Slayer. And thanks for dipping. Dipping low. Man, he had to dip both attacks. Slayer is slaying that ass, though. <laughs> that ass, though, got slayed. Boop, boop, boop. Pups are being a pain in the butt.
Nice job, Slayer. Good job slaying that ass. <laughs> Sorry. So I had to skip some of those, I gotta speed this up a little bit. Great job, Luke. Help the match with us. A defenseless town hall eight. We have a defenseless Town Hall 10, so can't complain about it. It's something that's built into the game that you can do. It's not a third party application, so it's not cheating for those who think it's cheating to have a defenseless base. Basically the same concept as going to 9.5 keep your war weight down maximize your offense if you don't like it suck it guys that's it um let's check out uh, the next war we have four elevens they have four elevens they have four tens we have two plus experiment so 
So they have four plus two of these. Oh, but he's got an Inferno Tower too. Hmm. Alright, that one should be interesting. We'll see. Until next time, keep clashing.